hey y'all i'm closing personal what up so i'm doing um i'm doing a makeup video today with some assumptions about me let me look at my hair right let me try to do um a transition right no i think it's gotta be wait A cut? Did that work? Did I make the transition work? I have no idea. <laughs> I hope I did. <laughs> but this is how the hair looks like. I'm gonna put it in the back because I have to do some makeup and we do not want hair in our faces, do we? Oh my God, it's gonna rain. I really hope that does not disturb the sound for me. I'll kind of like make the hair look good again later. So this is my plain bare face. And I always start with my brows. I'm gonna do, I did this look sometime back on, uh, <coughs> I did this look sometime back on TikTok and people liked it. I was like, okay, so and some of you guys too, because I think I posted on Snapchat too, and maybe Instagram, I'm not sure, on my story. And uh, you guys wanted to see how I do my colorful looks, so we are doing a neon look today. I'm going to try to make it neon, at least. Uh, yeah, and doing some assumptions about me. So I start by uh, combing out my brows. I use this eyebrow gel. Right here. I fell in love with somebody who doesn't even know my name, know my name. Oh, wait. I gotta find a way to like make sure you guys see everything. Yeah, that's comfortable right there. I think I need to clean my brows now. Because. Anyways, we are gonna do. I posted, um, I think some weeks back, week, a week ago, about a week ago. <laughs> I think I posted, I think it was a week ago, uh, and I was asking you guys for assumptions about me, and some of you responded. It was actually quite cute. It's not a lot, which is nice, so this video is not gonna be super long. And I use a brush like this for my brows. And then I also use powder for uh, my brows. I do not remember I bought this, but I think I bought it a while ago. I think it was either Beauty Bay or uh, I do not remember, but it's quite old. As you see, it's kind of like over there. Anywho, let's get into the brows. And do some assumptions. Okay. Okay, I have to concentrate when I do my brows so I cannot talk at the same time. Um, let me do this real quick and then get back to you guys with assumptions. Okay, so I'm gonna start by putting some uh, light concealer on my um, Smashbox. I'm gonna start by putting that on my eyelids because we're gonna use bright colors. I feel like I should be using brighter concealer, but this is what I have, so this is what we work with, sis. This is what we work with. And let me start with the assumptions. So assumption number one, this guy wrote, where do you live in Stockholm? 
would like to have a weekend vlog with you mm, it's a pandemic <laughs> would have let you come to my house but like oh pandemic <laughs> who asks to meet in a pandemic are you fine are you not embarrassed and i do not live in stockholm plus that is not an assumption can you read first and now anyways we move i did not mean to attack like that but ciao again it's a pandemic leave me alone and then the next one was <laughs> i'm sorry my friends are dumb you can what that you can fart and poop at the same time can human beings do that can human beings like fart and poop can you fart and poop at the same time i have no idea Says i do not know if i can do that i have i've never really thought about it Ooh. Make sure you really blend because this is what's gonna not define, but it might kind of like affect how the things look like later. And let's blend the next one. And what I like about this concealer is like quite matte. Actually, I do not need um powders and stuff when i'm done most times because it's not as um it's not super sticky and oily so it quite works for me i'm really sorry you guys if the lighting is shitty in here because today is such a cloudy day and everything is just not working out for me but we'll move and right now, I'm going to show you guys what colors I'm going to use. I'm using this palette right here. Me, myself, and Mitchell. I think that's how you say it. And I'm going to use uh, these colors. I'm going to use... Oh, wait. I'm going to use these three right here to kind of bring out the neon look. I don't like the yellow. It kind of like gets quite weird sometimes, but I definitely like these right so i'm basically gonna get any get any kind of fluffy brush because we're gonna start on top and i'm gonna go in with this color right here it's called mad <laughs> going to the color mad Ooh, wait i need a mirror And you're just gonna go like is it at the crease I'm so bad at words also so I'm not really sure how to explain so I'm just gonna show you guys I hope you guys really get it but right up there and blend it in so good it kind of looks it's supposed to even be a bit more red but it gets a bit darker when you just put it like this Okay, the next assumption about me is you hate <laughs> my friends are trash there are some assumptions i'm not about to put on youtube because you guys it's really it's revealing look at me my ink is disappearing divine i'm gonna tell you that in person okay okay baby girl because i ain't about to put that on youtube are you mad i ain't about to do that so you're just gonna go in and blend and then do like a little bit I really hope this turns out good because then i'm not posting this video anyways we skip that question we skip that assumption and then um the next one is i always thought you were shy but that's not the case no i'm actually kind of not shy and then i'm gonna go in with a little bit of an orange to put it in there so that it's not so it's not super red right At the, is it called the crease what is this i don't know yep so you're then gonna go in with um a bit of a thicker brush okay wait let me put this one right here because we are about to dab on some colors i'm gonna get i'm gonna get this one right here i'm gonna have to look at you guys i'm sorry i'm gonna get this kind of brush right here and i'm gonna go in with the orange and basically dab it right at the front okay you guys can just see 
okay uh yeah i'm not no you're right um this assumption was oh my god the fuck i always thought you were shy but that's not the case no i'm not really shy i mean i can i can get shy i feel like depending on the situation depending on who i'm with where i am and all that but um, i'm not quite shy actually i think yeah no i'm not <laughs> And then this one, and then the next assumption is, you don't, hmm. basically to summarize the whole thing, my own voice turns me on. Well, that's new. I never thought of it like that. But here's the thing, you guys, I actually enjoy hearing me talk. I never thought about it until I started YouTube, okay? And then I was like, oh my God, this is nice. I, like I could watch my own videos. I enjoy watching my own videos. If you guys don't, then, well... I mean, you're, like, watching me, so you probably do, too. <laughs> yeah, I enjoy watching my own videos, but I've never really thought of it like that. My own voice turns me on. Ciao! Anyways, keep dabbing. I'm gonna put a lot of color. So, you kind of dab it on like that. You don't really mix it all up, because then the color is not gonna be as... As seen as it should right oh I love this orange you guys look at this okay next assumption about me you have a fat ass yeah I have a fat ass <laughs> I got a stink ass walk and a reckless ass walk. Got a stink ass walk. I got a fat ass. Why? Wait, let me talk to me nice. But mm hmm. Okay, and as soon as you kind of feel comfortable with the color, you can go in and blend the top a little bit. Because it's very... Okay, I feel like I need a smaller brush than this. It's too big. I'm going to get this one. Because it'll go in real nice. Right up there. And what's going to make it neon is... I'm going to go in, go back in with the color mag. And a little bit of a yellow. To like... Make it a bit crazy, you know? And you still dab, of course. Next assumption, you're always laughing. Yeah, I'm always laughing. I would literally laugh in situations that I'm not supposed to be laughing in. Like, when you're telling me something serious, before I even realize that it is actually serious, like, yo, what's going on? My stupid ass will start laughing and I'm like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I didn't mean to. <laughs> but I do. Yo, stay happy, you guys. Life is too short. Bro. But as you see, I'm kind of blending the upper part a little bit, you know, to kind of match with the color that I have put at first. And since I'm not really happy with that, I'm just going to go in and dab again until the color becomes what I want it to be. Ooh, and a bit more yellow. I'm not a makeup guru, you guys. I actually just enjoy... Um, I've been enjoying makeup these days. It's quite nice. So, I feel like I'm always learning all the time. But, this is how I do it. Okay, next assumption. I think you seem like a relationship type of girl. It can be fucked with other things. Yeah, I'm a very much relationship type of person. <laughs> I'm like... I don't think you know these people who can just like you just randomly hook up with anybody like you don't it doesn't really matter i can't do that because you know what's gonna happen i'm gonna get attached okay and then you ask me how i'm doing i'm gonna get more attached i feel like if i'm gonna do that then we're not gonna talk anything i don't want to know anything about you because once i start to like mm, i don't know i don't know like i'm a, i'm very lovey-dovey i'm very into love I'm, I'm very in love with love so uh yeah, that's not my vibe, really. So, yeah, I'm very much a relationship type of person. 
so i'm just going in with all the three colors so that it can like blend nice and like make sure the not thickest what is it called english the brightest area is like right down here and then it becomes a bit more reddish but like the neon ish color is down here i think i like it i'm gonna go ahead and uh, yeah i'm my relationship type of girl you know that's my vibe i feel like if we talk for a while we're probably gonna get in a relationship i have no idea anyways let me go ahead and do the second eye off camera it's gonna look exactly like this um otherwise this video is gonna take long i am done with the other eye so next we're gonna go in with eyeliner because i always have eyeliner you'll know me already you already know next assumption uh, you want to be a basketball wife of course one of your basketball wife girls <laughs> stop <laughs> I feel like in another life, I'm probably a basketball wife. I feel like that is so weird though, because it's something that like, I've always... Can you fetishize over something like that? Is that... <laughs> Let me clown myself on YouTube, right? Because I don't think... It's not... You don't just be like... I don't know, but everybody has has types. Everybody has that, that, that thing that they always want their person to be doing. Anyways, God will bring what he wants to me. Okay? But in another life, I'm a basketball wife already, okay? I feel like I'm 22. I'm already probably having a house somewhere. Mm. Okay, next assumption. You're annoying. The guy who wrote this, I'm probably, I haven't even reached your last nerve yet. Just wait for it. But I love you. <laughs> I can be, I can be quite annoying. Oh my God, how do I put like, how do people do this? How do people do makeup and talk at the same time? It doesn't work for me. Like, you know what? So I just did this one eye and I realized maybe you guys might want to see how I put my eyeliner. So I'm going to try, but I'm not going to talk because <laughs> I cannot do that at the same time. Anyways, so I start by putting like a tiny straight line. As you'll see right up there, I put like a straight line. So I start by doing... I'm done. That's how I do some eyeliner. And then I'm going to go in with some mascara and then put lashes. Okay. Next assumption. Uh, you love me. Yes, Nina Roxburg. This is a really good friend of mine. I love you, babes. And I really don't like the fact that we do not have, we do not get to meet as much as we used to. But I love you. You know I love you. Okay. I'm going to put some. I'm really lazy to put lashes, but like lashes add a, add a lot to a look, you know? But I'm gonna start with some mascara first and then put lashes after. And I usually put mascara down too, but I'm not gonna do that because I need to put the whole full face makeup before I do that. Anyways, lashes. I'm back. I'm done with lashes. I had to put them off camera because... It takes a whole long process. I feel like I've learned how to do eyeliner peacefully, but when it comes to, um, oh, I need a mirror. But when it comes to eyelashes, cha, I'm still learning. I'm still out here learning, honestly. But it's okay, we're getting there. My next assumption, hey, <laughs> my friends are clowns, y'all. My friends are motherfucking clowns. You are a horny person. I am trying to keep this video PG. What is wrong with you? When you sat down and wrote this question, were you not embarrassed? Are you not embarrassed? This is really embarrassing. I am not gonna answer that because for safety purposes, I'm gonna choose to not put that on the YouTube. But God, let's move. <laughs> Anyways, now these are anonymous. These were from the ones I, was, I just did were all Instagram. So now we are gonna go to the anonymous ones. I have no idea who wrote this, but I'm gonna go in with my foundation. I actually just bought a new one, which you guys saw my vlog. So let's 
So let's get into it. Let's get into it. I don't even know how much foundation I'm going to put. But next one, you are a child of God. Yes. Whoever said that, I am. I know you got to remember your God, yeah? You all should remember your God. I feel like it's a whole long ass topic that I'll probably get into like someday or not. <laughs> But yes, I'm a child of God. Okay, next assumption. You're an awkward black girl. Sis, why are you going to tag me like that? Am I? I have no idea, actually. Am I? Am I an awkward? I can get awkward. But no, I don't know. I feel like I have it easy to talk to literally anybody. Honestly, anybody. I could talk to anybody. So we're going to dab, dab, dab. I could literally talk to anybody. So I'm not sure. Um... It was situations where I do get like awkward and stuff. But okay, I mean, if you think so, I'm not, but we move. And the next assumption is you're really smart. Thank you. I'm gonna take that as a compliment. I don't really consider myself dumb. <laughs> I don't know if there's anybody who does that. Does anybody ever like look at themselves and they're like, okay, I have better lighting in this side? Does anybody ever look at themselves and they're like, I'm dumb? I think I'm smart. Yeah, no, I am. I think I'm smart. Well, school smart. Street smart, I'm not so sure. I try. <laughs> but I'm going to take that as a compliment. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. And then the next assignment. <laughs> Wait, let me finish with this foundation out here. Uh I feel like, when, you know, when you're doing makeup and, like, things are not really adding up yet because you haven't made your whole face yet. And then, like, you put foundation and suddenly things are looking cute. Things are looking nice. Like, right now, I'm starting. What did I just put this? I need a little bit more. And things are starting to look good. Right now, I'm liking what I'm seeing. Ooh, I did not put any right there. And what I love about this foundation is that it's also matte. So it's not super oily. Because I'm not such an oily person. But at the same time, I'm also, I also don't have a super dry skin. So I'm somewhere there in the middle. Mix it all up. Next assumption. You're low-key freaking secret. What kind of what kind of assumptions are y'all giving me? <laughs> yeah, but like, who is it? What? I don't know. Anyways, we are keeping things PG. Next. <laughs> Next. Um, you low-key want to dance again. Though you do have art right now. Oh, that is so true. I actually miss dancing. I feel like I had a lot in school. Like when I was still actually like studying. And I never had time to like dance. You know, I live in a small town. For those who know, I actually live in a really small town. There isn't so much dancing going on. Okay, I think I'm done with them. Ooh. What is that? And don't forget your neck, you guys. So I feel like my eyes are what takes a bit longer. And then after that, I'm good. <laughs> yeah, so I do. Uh, I was telling you guys, I live in a small town. And there isn't so much to do, actually. Uh, it's so, so hard to like get into something some type of dance and i always have to go to like another city to dance and when i was in school i never had time for that i never had time to do any of it uh, and then i'm gonna go in with concealer i literally use the same one throughout i never really had time to to dance and when i even finished school there was a whole pandemic going on because normally i go to um what where's my brush normally i usually like when like when i'm in stockholm i usually take a few dance classes which is really nice i'm not a fan of just doing it in my living room like or in my my room i don't know i feel like i already work in my room i don't want to hate it i feel like, like you know the table environment every time i sit there i'm just like i gotta work i gotta film i gotta you know something so i don't want my whole room to be like this area where i don't know i still want to be able to be comfortable right okay so i'm gonna put I'm going to put a little bit. I've never learned how to put so much, you guys, because I don't know. I'm scared that I might fuck it up, but that's the process. 
yeah but i really hope i could get back to dancing someday soon hopefully next year but i'm trying to also get good at what i'm doing with even the work that i'm having so i don't really have time to dance because i don't want to just dance in my room i mean it's not it's not as fun i miss taking classes and the excitement of being with like other people and all dancing and learning things and then suddenly you know a whole choreography like that that was lit but hopefully i'm gonna get back to it you see this makes my nose very very tiny and shiny <laughs> next assumption you own a lot of clothes now may god bless you whoever decided to write that because i do not no, I, I i mean i do have clothes let me not lie i do have clothes but i wish i had more because i want to show you guys clothes i want to show you guys how to style different things but then you know y'all we live on a budget you know life is a whole struggle okay i cannot do this and talk at the same time so wait <clears throat> yeah as i was saying i do not have as much clothes as i would like to but it's coming we're getting there every day i keep buying something there is also i just actually recently bought a few clothes which i'm so excited about there's this whole like leather trend thing going on and i'm loving it it's quite nice it's quite nice so <laughs> i'm gonna be i'm gonna be i'll be doing a haul pretty soon and like how to style different outfit things but i do not have a lot of clothes i kind of i mean i do have clothes but not not as much as i would want so i do not contour you guys because i do not know how to i wish i did i don't know how to contour so i don't do it i just i just don't do it i, I powder myself after i don't really need to put powder if i don't want to so sometimes i just don't when i'm trying to do like natural looks but since my powder is quite dark i just do like something like that literally this is how my whole makeup routine is on any makeup i feel like the eyes are always different but everything else i do exactly this i really don't do anything different and then i'm a blush girl so of course i'm gonna put a little bit of blush next assumption um you're a true loving sister anybody would wish for. That was really cute. That was one of the cutest literally that I got. <laughs> that was so sweet. Thank you. I, I am though. I, I feel like I really value my um friendship <clears throat> with my with my sister. And not only I feel like you kind of make family along the way with like some people you meet. Like some people have family without having to actually be family. Yeah, when i tell you i'm gonna prioritize you yeah when i love you i love you all the way like i'm never i don't have any oh shit i just put it low but let me correct this a bit i just do that and a little blush a little i feel like i put a lot but yeah um i do value like my my friends my close friends my family so I guess I am. I think so. I hope that's what they think. Y'all can just ask them. So this is today's look, you guys. I'm kind of done. I don't do much more, honestly. Like, I don't put highlighter because I just don't. I rather have my cheeks fully red. I've never really gotten onto the highlight highlighter hype. That was on some time back. I never really got there. So it's never been my thing. I mean, I would put it just because I have to. But like, not really. And I'm going to go ahead and put... Ooh, oh my god, everything is falling. Let me comb this out. I'm going to go ahead and put some mascara like right under. Because I did not do it earlier. Okay. 
I hope I didn't do anything. Okay. Yes, that is today's look. Okay, let me go ahead and spray myself. Spray yourself, sis, so that she can stay. Quite nice, quite nice. <clears throat> but this is today's look. I am gonna go ahead and change clothes so that I can look a bit human for you guys. Should I do it now? I'm not gonna do another transition. Let's just let's just move into it. Let's just and this is the final look. I went ahead and put on some gloss. I'm a gloss girl. I've never really understood lipsticks. Because my lips, my lips don't my lips got issues anyway so we're just going with glass um but this is the final look and since it's a very bright color i style it with black i'm putting on um black leather dress which is so cute you will get to see it really soon too but i hope you guys enjoyed this video this was actually cute i enjoyed doing this and i'll get back to you guys next week or see you next week don't forget to like don't forget to share and subscribe and by the way i'm almost hitting 100 subscribers and i'm really really happy about that thank you for everybody who is taking their time and actually watching my videos and subscribing and liking and interacting literally anything so there's definitely something coming up somebody one of you is about to get a cute ass christmas gift so i'm gonna once i hit 100 i'm gonna order a few things and i'm gonna do a giveaway but Thank you guys for watching. See you next week.